Good morning everyone and welcome to the vlog. McKinnon got up early, but we've been having fun this morning, haven't we? Yeah, she's been super active in her little play gate thing. I don't want to, I don't know what to call it. I don't want to call it a play pen because I feel like that sounds like really mean. Like I'm putting my baby in a play pen. <laughs> but I think on the box they call it a play yard. So I guess it's her play yard. Yeah. I guess so. What's cool about this thing though is um, it says on there that you can take it like to the beach and like outdoor stuff like to the park so that'll be cool that we can take it to the beach um, but we just bought like this really cool wagon that we can take to the beach so I don't think that we'll take the play yard to the beach anytime soon. Play yard, that's a better name for it. When Matthew comes home we're gonna eat and then we're gonna go to Baby's R.S. Um, and then we need to go and get grocery stuff and some baby stuff too. Unless they have it at Baby's RS and it's on sale, then we can get it there. Yeah. We just got a ginormous Amazon delivery and it's all stuff for McKinnon. It's for like, I think two things, but it's Easter stuff for her. So I'm super excited. My parents never went like all out for our Easter baskets. Like it was always my grandma who did it, which I mean, my mom sent a giant Easter basket for McKinnon, so. <laughs> but at least for like when she's really young, I wanna do some stuff for her. And some of it honestly like isn't really for her. It's just like baby stuff that I want to get for her that she kind of like needs I guess I'll show y'all on Easter well actually maybe I'll do a like a video on my main channel or what do y'all think should I do a video on my main channel or just like put it in a vlog like do a little bit of um, what to put in a baby's Easter basket or what's in my baby's Easter basket something like that um, let me know do you want to see that on my main channel do y'all want to see it in a vlog what do you want me to do because I think it would be fun to do something like that because I know when I went to like figure out what I wanted to put in there I was like what do you even put in a six month old baby or well she's gonna be seven months um, but what do you even put in her Easter basket <laughs> um, there was only one thing I knew I was gonna put in there I keep stopping to film hoping that I'm going to catch her crawling for the first time. <laughs> She's in between those two little arches, so that probably makes it a little bit more difficult. She's reaching for a toy, so she's getting a little frustrated. Not sure I feel about this just yet, but we'll see. It's on a uh, stabilizing arm, so McKinnon. All right, McKinnon, what do you what do you think we're doing today? Are we gonna go to the toy store? Could you use some toys? I've got the camera on this little gimbal thing. I'm kinda curious to see how it actually looks. I'm not really interested in using it for daily vlogging because it weighs a billion pounds. But it's um should be good for our Disney kind of Sierra calls it artsy fartsy <laughs> style stuff, so should be interesting. Matthew's using this new fun little gadget he got. <laughs> um, we are leaving right now to go to Baby's RS, but we're gonna stop and get coffee first. McKinnon looks so cute in her glasses. She's pulling them off right now, but <laughs> this is freaking adorable. <laughs> now she's gonna try to eat them, but she did look really cute. I'll insert a photo. So our babies are us. I'm surprised that a lot of stuff is not on sale. Like diapers and wipes. Like there's a ton of diapers and wipes and like none of that is on sale. You think they'd just be trying to get rid of it? Yeah. Like aren't they gonna close? Yeah. I guess I'm, they still gotta make money on it. I'm wanting to get shoes for her. 
care that didn't work. But like the shoes aren't on sale. Well, at least the ones that we are looking at. There might be some that are on sale. None of this stuff is on sale. None of this stuff is on sale. Well, yeah, but that was $84.98 from $99.99. That's not really oh. like sale. That's just, it's weird, isn't it? Yeah. I kind of want to get this for McKinnon so she can just have it in the living room and like eat stuff in there. But I don't know. It's not on sale. <laughs> <laughs> they don't want to get rid of it. <laughs> McKenna is falling asleep in her throne. She's bored with shopping. <laughs> Mainly yeah. because I'm not shopping for clothes. Filming our little sleeping baby. Mm -hmm. Cute tootsies. What are we doing next? I Matthew? don't know. We're going to Target. We're going to try to get to Target. We're going to go to Target. Did she wake up yet? No. So we were gonna get her clothes here, but things aren't actually marked down. Like we were saying earlier, things aren't marked down because, what did they say, Matthew? They hadn't been told to do any of that yet. Like, they haven't officially yeah. decided to mark everything down. Like, yeah. they're definitely closing because they've already fought, they fought bankruptcy last year. Yeah, but they haven't... Started. Did, yeah, they haven't started. Did, did the person say like next month they're gonna be doing it? They didn't say anything. So I guess we just have to check back at some point. Yeah, we can call in and ask at some point. Be like, excuse me, is everything up for you now? <laughs> yeah, so right now the stuff is marked down. It's just like normal sales. But stuff isn't marked like way down yet. But we're still going to use our gift card and get some wipes. Because we need wipes. So yeah. Super But we found exciting. this Mickey Mouse umbrella stroller. It's super cute. I don't know what's happening. There it is. <laughs> but we're not going to get it because we use the stroller for storage at the park. Yeah, we pretty much just fill it up with stuff, so. We do, but we need that, though. We have so much stuff at the parks for, like, vlogging and her. Like, That's diking. true. If she was older, it would make sense. No, I still wouldn't want to carry a backpack. You know what I'm saying? Like, she, she won't need so much stuff when she's older. Yeah, but I still wouldn't want to carry a backpack, and that literally has zero storage in it. Yeah, that's true. So, I vote no. Oh gosh. What's happening? Y'all, I hate this thing. I hate this thing. This thing has a thing. mind of its own. I hate it. I have no idea how to use this. That's what I'm realizing. <laughs> I hate it. I, th I think it's in a different mode. Like, every time I turn it on, I think it goes in a different mode. So, like, this, like, watch if I tilt it, it turns, apparently. <laughs> That's kind of cool, but I had no idea that that's what that was doing. <laughs> Let's get some wipes and go to Target. <laughs> what? Let's get some wipes and go to Target. Okay. It's very slowly moving. McKinnon's <laughs> chowing down on some fries. Well, a fry. <laughs> that camera needs battery. It does. McKinnon! McKinnon. I think you missed your mouth. Just by a little bit. <laughs> it's okay. You're slowly getting the hang of it. <laughs> it would make her want to grab her feet even more because she loves glitter. She's got her foot up ready for you. <laughs> She's like, all right. I'm, like I'm all right with these shoes. <laughs> <laughs> they fit your, your toe was like barely. <laughs> Like Look at here. Her face. Let's see. <laughs> like it just like she just doesn't have her foot flat. That's why it looks like Look it's. She's like, why are you doing this to me? <laughs> so we've actually been home for quite a while. I'm about to go to bed, but I have to tell you all this story. I'm about to start making Matthew's lunch for work tomorrow, so I'm just gonna sit y'all here. When we were at Target today, I was in the baby section and or, or we were in the baby section and Matthew had to go to the restroom so he left there was like a buy one dress get one fifty percent off sale um so I was of course looking at dresses from McKinnon which I got some I will show y'all tomorrow and these two ladies like a young mom and like an older lady um they both were like 
oh my gosh, that is the cutest baby ever. And I was like, aw, you know, like, that's so sweet. Like, people say that all the time, and that's pretty much where it ends. They just say, oh, your baby's so cute. And I say, oh, thank you. And then that's it. That is not where it ended. <laughs> the older lady, the, first of all, let me say, the younger lady was like, really sweet. She had like a two-year-old daughter, not with her, but like, she was telling me she had a two-year-old two-year-old daughter but the older lady after she says your daughter is so cute and all that like she says do you want me to hold her and give you a little break so you can look at dresses and I was like that's really weird to say to someone and I honestly thought she was joking but I was like oh no you know just like I kind of brushed it off but then as we continued talking she came over there and was like touching McKinnon's legs because I was holding McKinnon at this point and she was like oh you're so cute and then she kept like putting her hands out like you want to come to me you want to come to me and it oh my gosh like I was getting so freaked out a little while later Matthew comes back and at this point they're both still talking to me I would be totally okay with just saying I would be totally okay with them talking to me if this lady wasn't still trying to hold McKinnon. She, at one point, while well, I think this was after Matthew got back, she even looked over and she was like, aren't your arms getting tired? Are you sure you don't want me to take her off your hands? And I was like, first of all, I have a stroller right here. If my arms are getting tired, I'm gonna put my baby in a stroller, not hand her over to a stranger. And second of all, that is super weird and creepy that you were asking to hold my baby. You do not know me. So at that point, I was getting super freaked out. And Matthew, I'm pretty sure Matthew was too. He was like, what in the world is going on here? So we tried to get out of there as quick as we possibly could the younger girl she was like all right well i'll let y'all go you know have a good night but the older lady was like oh no i'm going with them and i'm sitting there thinking you are not going with us like you are not following us around the store and touching our baby like oh my gosh i was getting so freaked out and she was like pulling out her phone and showing us like photos of her like kid like who was like 35. It was so weird. Like it was one of the most awkward and uncomfortable situations I've ever been in. And it is the first situation I've ever been in where I felt so protective of McKinnon because I was like, another person is literally trying to hold my baby. A person that I don't know is trying to take my baby. Needless to say, I was freaking out. But I had to tell y'all that crazy story because we were both just like, what was that? <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up or share or comment, whatever you'd like to do. And I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye.